Good morning. Vault Tech calling. Confirm reports of nuclear oh detonations. Oh my God. Vault 111. I'll take Sean with me. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the pod. Please be still the backup. I'll find who did this. Enjoy your return to the surface. Codsworth, you're still here. 200 years? There's still people alive in Concord? You want to come with me, Phil? Be ready to deal with the Raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? You guys pay for things with bottle caps? I've got a group of settlers inside! Help us! Please! Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minutemen. Your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minutemen. Maybe. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. Huh. Who are these people? Uh, that ain't it. Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's old Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. You really aren't from around here, are you? Ghouls are irradiated people. Most are just like you and me. They look pretty messed up and live for a Maybe. long time, but they're still just people. <sighs> nope. The ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. They'll rip you apart just as soon as look at you. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Will it be enough to stop those maniacs? Sturgis, tell her. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. Pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What makes that power armor so special? A West Tech internalized servo system, that's what! Inside that baby, super is the new normal. You'll be stronger, tougher, resistant to rats, and... Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? And I can use the minigun like a rifle. Don't see why not. It'll have a manual trigger. Just aim it at the bad guys and do the old spray and pray. Now, as for the armor, it's out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. So what's the solution? What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, 
I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. You're not what I expected dog meat would find in that little neighborhood. But oh, so much better. He's a good dog. Smart, too. Oh, indeed. Dog meat's good at finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you now. I saw it. You saw it? It's the Kems, kid. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. Been that way for as long as I can remember. That's incredible. I can see a bit of what was and what will be. And even what is right now. And right now, I can see there's something coming, drawn by the noise and the chaos. And it is angry. What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more. Please. I see. I see. Oh. It's... It's horrible, kid. Claws and teeth and horns. The very face of death itself. That's all I can manage. That's all. I need to rest now. And you have a job to do. You all right? Oh, 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 oh. I, I promised we'd get there. I promised. I, I promised we'd get there. I promised. I, I couldn't keep my promise. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Yeah, poor Jew. We can't just stay trapped in here. This is ridiculous! S somebody do something! Okay, okay. Make it quick. They mask for another attack. I won't be able to hold them. Up go. Yes. Okay. Hey, Sturgis. Wanna try? You can't do any worse than me. Okay. Alright, I guess we're gonna try our hand at hacking, so. Alright. Alright, so if you're new to Fallout, the Fallout games at all, or hacking in general, if you're not good at it, I'll give you guys a quick tutorial in this video. What I usually do is I start out with one word, um, the first one that it is, and then go from there. So obviously the words will be highlighted, but additionally, like you saw here, or like you see here, I should say. Um, these little, I guess, symbols will be highlighted inside the two brackets. That works for anything that has brackets. What that does, it either replenishes your attempts, or resets your attempts, or it will remove some duds. So let's start with the first one. Sometimes you get lucky in that first word, um, but I always start with there, so sword. Zero likeness, okay. So anything that starts with an S ends with a D, it will not be the same. So, S O R D, so it ends with a D, no. B A N D S, bands, so we can try that one. That has one likeness. On the third attempt, I usually will um, start narrowing it down, but you can do that beforehand as well. So, I can start doing this. So, I'll hit that one. That's going to reset my t tries. Then, I can also reset this one. So, that'll remove a dud. Uh, that one will remove a dud, that will remove a dud. 
So I'll go through and hit all these. It kind of depends. Um, but yeah, I usually go through and hit all these just to get all the duds removed. So, and sometimes uh, when you have a bracket over the dots, it also then can remove a dud or reset your tries. So, so. My guess will be either claws or scout. No, nope, claws would be so claws. Yep, yeah, there it is. So let's unlock the security gate real quick. Okay. Like it or not, we're all counting on you. Thanks, Preston. All right. I'm also going to look at the log entry, so... After hours tomfoolery. <laughs> How are people playing with the mannequins? I don't know. <laughs> Roaches in the basement? Oh, boy. Yeah, that wouldn't be too fun, having um, someone have a cockroach in their hair while at the museum. That's just gross. Anchorage exhibit? Oh, it's been put on a hold. Not, with, not in the budget. That's a shame. Final entry. This is the day the bombs fell. feel bad for her. Um, I don't think she made it. She might have, though. Look at you! A bona fide computer genius. Thanks. Sturgis. Damn! You made that look way too easy. Thank you, sir. I need check the future for. Okay. Everything's normal. Everything's fine. Oh. Miss this. Oh. Okay. I'll grab that and that. You can keep the skull. Anything over here? Nope. Oh, okay. All right. I got the fusion core, Preston. Where do I go? Look, Sturgis may be big, but he ain't much good in a fight. I need you to do this. I get that. Where do I go? <clears throat> Man, what are you waiting for? For you to tell me where to go. Through the back room and up to the roof. I'll hold them off from here. Go. Okay. Got it. That's what I was waiting for. We can't just stay trapped in here. This is ridiculous. Somebody do something! Oh, hey, these are our God, lives why? you're playing with. Why, 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 are you why, listening why? to me? Okay. It's not fair. Hang in there, June. Oh. Hey, I guess, uh, there's a vertebrate. Alright. Let's get this power armor. Hey, caps. That was quick. Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause? EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global event. The co-pilot was killed on impact. The pilot died of his injuries a day later. The day after that, Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared, desperate survivors. Then Brzezanski took off running. Haven't seen him since. Now, it's my turn to go AWOL, if that concept even applies anymore. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so... I guess my soldering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot, to 
to see if my sister survived all this. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. This is Mike Daly, signing out. Good luck. And God bless America. Or what's left of it. Oh. Well, I guess that explains the murder bird. Oh. Well, you alright, Dogmeat? Took a tumble, did you? Good to see you're back and healthy. Okay, let's get into this power armor. Look at that. Try not to fall this time. Unless it's on purpose. Up Grab here. It. Boss! We got somebody up here! This is all... Did you see that? We've got company. Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up close. Not a lot of people can get past my boys. I'll give you that. All right, say less. Here I am. How are you running? Come on. I'm running, I'm running. Woo. I got all day. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Uh oh. I'm gonna get some grenades out. Alright, dog meat, I'm coming. Oh, it's coming back, it's coming back. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Dog meat. Did I hit it at all? At all. You dog meat, but I want you to come with me. Hey, come on over here. Over here, dog meat. Move here. All right, here. Head over there. Wait there. Stay, stay there. Hey, okay. I'll come get you after <laughs> get this thing. All right, I think I used my fragment grenade, so I'm gonna grab some Molotovs. Oh, I was close. 
Oh, okay. He's dead. He's dead. Okay. Almost burned out my fusion core. Alright, dog meat. Hey, come on. We're good now, buddy. Grab these caps. Yeah, there we go. Oh, he's got a backpack. Yeah, that was pretty rough. That death guy he came out of here. What'd you find? Oh, nice. Nice. And shotgun shells. I can use that. Just get all the weapons and ammo. If anything, I'll scrap or sell the weapons. Move my helmet. Alright, let's go check on the settlers. You okay? I'm fine, Preston. Quit fussing. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. You guys going to be okay now? Yeah. For a while, anyway. We can at least move someplace safer. Listen, when we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here. It ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Because there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. My destiny? What do you mean? You are a woman out of time. Out of hope. But all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. I knew it. Please, tell me where he is. I need to find my son. I can't see him. Not clearly, but I feel his life force. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Well, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, well, she's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can oh, hardly hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then. Sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh, okay. Okie dokie. Don't forget the price we paid to get this far. Let's move out. I'll take point. Stay close, everyone. We're right behind you, boss. I still can't believe you took that thing out. First time I've seen one of these things up close. I'm very glad it's already dead. Yeah. It was one heck of a fight. Ugh, 
can't say I'm gonna miss this festering boil on the ass end of the Commonwealth. Uh, no offense if you're from here or something. <laughs> I'm taken. Where are we going, Marcy? Don't worry, June. Just stay with me. It'll be fine. Oh. O okay. Well, look at that. I think I just found my new vacation home. Your idea of heaven, eh, Sturgis? Could be some good salvage in there. Let's get to Sanctuary first, though. I think we're close. Well, I'll be damned. It's the monument to the original Minutemen. I knew that was somewhere around Concord. That means this right here must be the Old North Bridge, where the first shots of the American Revolution were fired. I'd call that the best omen I've seen since we left Quincy. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking what about, boss. For. But I'm glad you're happy about it. I guess we made it. Let's go talk to Codsworth real quick. There he is. Hey, Codsworth. Miss Lucy, welcome back, Mum. I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Conco. How are things here while I was gone? No, oh, just catching up on some old yard work with the occasional pest control. And you, Mum. Anything to be found in Conco? You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but... If needed, I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Would you like to? As you wish, Mum. Yes, of course. As you wish, Mum. Hey. Mum? Codsworth. Can I help you, Mum? Your thoughts? I wonder what Diamond City will be like. If the name has anything to do with it, it must be quite nice. Are things all right between us? Hard to tell, Mum. I feel we're more acquaintances than anything these days. You just haven't been yourself lately. Nothing else for now. All right, then. All right. I'm gonna get out of this power armor. <laughs> Talk to Preston. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? So, do you believe in these visions she has? I didn't used to. But how did she know about this place? I think she has some kind of a gift. Best not to ignore it. I mean, look at this place. I really think this could be what we've been looking for. I don't know. It's strange being back here. What do you mean? You used to live here or something? What do you think I'm saying? Well, that you're from before the war. The Great War. Like one of those old ghouls you sometimes run into. Is that true? Ghouls from before the war? Yeah. I've run into a few that old. I guess ghouls don't really age. Radiation preserves them or something. Obviously, you're no ghoul, but the way you were talking made me wonder. That's all. Yeah, sort of. I was born over 200 years ago, but I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Just my son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. Have you run across anybody with a baby boy? Damn. I'm sorry. But no. I haven't run across any kidnapped babies. I'll definitely keep an eye out for him. Anyway, I am glad you're here. 
and I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. 